Father, we thank you, we bless you, we give you praise for such a, another wonderful time in your presence. We are so grateful for giving us today. We know your presence with us, and therefore there's going to be a wonderful move of your spirit. Today is day two of our eight days uh, journey. Uh, wherever you are, I know you are cheer up, you are in tune in the spirit, and you can't wait, hallelujah, to burst into prayer. We're not going to disappoint you at all in the name of Jesus. We want you to close your eyes as we pray. Let's all pray right now. I want you to commit yourself, commit your family, everyone that is with you. Shall we begin to pray and ask for the presence of the Holy Spirit? In the name of Jesus, ask the presence of the Holy Spirit. You see, we need to keep on. Hallelujah. Asking the presence of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus. Let go everything. Let go everything. Let go everything. Let go everything. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Begin to pray now. 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 Give hallelujah in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Let the place where you are standing be saturated with the power of the Holy Ghost. In the name of Jesus, begin to pray, begin to pray. Father, we thank you. We bless you, we honor you, we glorify you. In the mighty name of Jesus, hallelujah. We commit this special moment into your hands, O oh Lord. We pray that we will be filled and in the chives and courage and boldness in the name of Jesus and that your power in Jesus mighty name we thank you we thank you your word said that and we shall receive power we shall receive power we have power in the name of Jesus hallelujah and therefore we speak with authority in the name of Jesus we thank you O oh Lord that you've covered us in the name of Jesus with your blood in the name of Jesus we thank you Lord we bless you Lord we honor you Lord we glorify you Lord we magnify you Lord we give you praise Jehovah God in the mighty name of Jesus Father we thank you now begin to bless the name of the Lord. Now begin to bless the name of the Lord. Begin to say lovely words unto him. Give him praise, give him glory. Give him praise, give him glory. The psalmist says, yes, I will bless the Lord. I will bless the Lord. Yes, choose to bless the Lord. Choose to give him praise. Give all the praise unto him. Under the name of the Lord, He is good and is mercy and pure forever. Mighty God, we give you praise. Mighty God, we give you glory. We honor you, precious Father. We honor you, mighty God. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you glory, Jehovah, in the name of Jesus. La Debene Akaba Akoshaba, Lebro Sante de Mama. Mighty God, we thank you. We bless you in the name of Jesus. We honor you in the name of Jesus. We honor you in the name of Jesus. We give you praise. We give you praise. We give you glory. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. One more time, shall we bless the name of the Lord? Let's bless the name of the Lord. Bible says that in all things we should give thanks. In all things we should give thanks. In the name of Jesus, open your mouth and begin to bless the name of the Lord. No matter how you are feeling, no matter how things that you are saying, we want to honor the Lord, the sovereign God. We want to bless His name. We want to give Him praise. We want to thank Him. We want to honor him, hallelujah. Yes, he's a loving God. He is a good God. He is a merciful God. And we want to bless his name. Somebody give God the praise. Somebody give God the glory. In the mighty name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. Father, we bless you. Father, we honor you. Maribaha. Lebo shakadamata bini inkabaha. In the name of Jesus.
Heavenly Father, we thank you. We honor you. In the name of Jesus. Tonight, we say, have your way. We pray that your presence will fill our hearts in the name of Jesus as never before. Glory be to you, Jehovah. May your name be exalted and glorify the symphony in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Please bear with us for a few minutes. We're going to go through a few scriptures. We're going to pray. Hallelujah. We came to join you, to pray with you. That's the main thing. We know that you've been doing your homework. You've been praying at home. You've been studying. You've been filled with the Holy Spirit. But we are joining you tonight to pray with you. Hallelujah. Till the end of this fast, every evening we'll come and we'll pray with you. Hallelujah. So we are here to pray with you. In the name of Jesus. But we need to open our seven things to you. Amen. As we started yesterday with a theme. He who knew no sin became sin for us. He took our place. He took our place. Let me make it personal. He took your place. Your place of condemnation. Your place of death. Your place of disaster. Your place of corruption. Your place of sickness. Your place of pain. He took that pain. That place. As I was saying, that was a great exchange. A great exchange. He reconciled us back to Give him praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Declare I will not die. I will live and, and, and serve the Lord. And serve the Lord. Dwell in the house of the Lord. You carry the praise of God. You carry the favor of God. You carry the goodness of God. You carry the message of God. Give God the praise. You will not die. But you will live. The words of the Lord. Hallelujah. You want to take your Bible with me quickly. Romans chapter 3. Romans chapter 3. Thank you, Lord. Wonderful people, we know you are doing very, very well. We thank God. Please continue to be in the spirit. Let's continue to pray together. Let's continue to fast. A certain moment will pray against all these things that are going on. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. God is with us. Romans chapter 3. Come with me. Romans 3. What a wonderful God we serve. Let's look at verse number 22. Number 22. Romans 3, 22. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we bless your name and we give you praise. We are made right with God. We, we, as I said earlier, when Christ took our punishment, Christ took your punishment. The punishment that what, what was there for us to go through, Christ took it. So therefore, there is no condemnation. Against you. So when you come to 22, he says that. And we are made right with God. By placing our faith in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. We are made right with God 
by placing our faith in Christ Jesus. The redemption price has already been paid. But we are to use our faith to appropriate, to take hold of that which Christ has already done. Praise the name of the Lord. Now it goes on to say, and this is true for everyone who believes. I like this part. He didn't say this is true for everyone. Because some of you or some folks may find it difficult to believe that how come? How can someone take away your punishment? Take away your burden? Hallelujah. But he made it very clear there. It is for those who believe. Yes, you may come up, well, me, I don't believe in certain things. Yes, it is clear because you don't believe so you're not going to have it. But he says, yes, sir. He has made it and true faith we possess it in Christ Jesus. Any punishment that was meant for you he says that now it has been taken away and we have the right standing with Christ, with God. Therefore, any punishment that will try to find its way into your life is from the devil. Trying to deceive you. Trying to give you information that is not from God. Trying to undermine that which Christ has done. But through faith in Christ Jesus, we are to lay claim of those things and tell the devil to shut up. He took our place. He was not meant to go through it. But he loved us. And therefore he took our place. We are not done yet. Hallelujah. Praise the name of the Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Number 23. As a matter of fact, let's finish the 22. He says that for everyone who believes, no matter who you are, no matter who you are, no matter who we are, it doesn't matter where you come from. It doesn't matter where you live. He says that for the fact that you have the ability to trust in the Lord, that case, that burden, is no longer on you. And if you believe, you say amen. We want to take this initiative. We want to take this process. And we're going to pray. We're going to pray. Hallelujah. For some time now, we've been so quiet in our corners, in our places. Hallelujah. But we are now to demonstrate that which Christ has made possible for us. Say glory. Hallelujah. Number 23. For everyone has sinned. Yes. For everyone has sinned. And we all fall short of God's glorious standard. Now listen to this, 24. Yet God freely, freely, say freely, freely, God freely and graciously declares that we are righteous. Ooh, what a glory. But God, all have sinned. We've acknowledged that we have sinned. We have acknowledged that things have gone wrong. We have acknowledged that we didn't believe in the Son Jesus Christ. But we have come back. And now we are in the right place. And Bible says that God freely and graciously oh praise the name of the Lord accepted us back. Call us in and declares that we are righteous. 
if you believe we say amen and declare that we are righteous he did this through Christ Jesus when he freed us from the penalty of our sins from the penalty of our sicknesses from the penalty of our diseases from the penalty of the sin that was meant to be upon us the curses that was meant to be upon us we have been freed why don't you say amen we have been freed so for him becoming a sin for us it means that he loved us and he took our place you are no longer carrying your sins anymore by coming to Christ Jesus. You are no longer in the name of Jesus. And let me go down a little bit and move, open up certain things also. 25. For God presented Jesus as a sacrifice for sin. are made right with God when they believe that Christ Jesus sacrificed his life shedding his blood this sacrifice shows that God was being fair when he held back and did not punish those who sinned in time past you want to bless the name of the Lord you want to give God the glory and you want to give God the honor for giving you this opportunity, for giving us this opportunity. And then we'll read 26 and move on. For he was looking ahead and including them in what he would do in this present time. God did this to demonstrate his righteousness for he himself is fair and just and he declares sinners to be right in his sight when they believed in Christ Jesus I don't know about you when the Bible says that your sins have been forgiven it also says that there is no burden on you anymore Evil one cannot lay any claim against you because you are now in the hands of God. God takes care of you and you are to know that and you are to believe that. And that makes sure that everything God has said concerning your life now it has the power and the ability to flow in your life because there is no contamination one thing that you need to understand very very clearly that as a believer you see you are to obey and know and believe what he has said that is all you need what he has said what he has said when your faith is in his it will go well with you in everything that you do. If you believe it, say amen. And I declare over your life and that of your family in the name of Jesus. As we cheer in towards a new level, a new dimension, a new move, a new atmosphere. May the power in you come alive in the name of Jesus. And anything that the devil is still holding on to, give way in Jesus' mighty name. Let that thing give way. Because, listen to me, we can be people of God and still holding on to the things that is of the devil. If our sins, the burden has been taken away. You see, the Bible says that if we have come into the light, then our deeds also must be of the light in the name of Jesus 
Father, we thank you. And we give you praise. A great exchange has taken place. You have in you the power of God. You have in you the glory of God. You have in you the anointing of God. You have in you the strength of God. In the name of Jesus. And we need to rise. We need to get up and start moving. Hallelujah. In the power of the Holy Ghost. I read the scripture and then we we'll start praying. First John chapter 2. First John chapter 2. First John, first John chapter 2. What a glory. Lord of hope. I want you to stay in tune as we are about to burst into uh, prayers. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. First John 2. Let's read from verse number 2. Listen to this very carefully. It says, He himself is the sacrifice that atones for our sins. And not only our sin, but the sins of all those, of all the sins of all the world. That we can be sure. Hallelujah. That you can be sure. That I can be sure. That we know him. And if we know him. This is what. It becomes evident. That we obey his commandments. And if someone claims. I know God. But does not obey. God's commandments. That person is a liar. Wow. That person is a liar. And it's not living in the truth. Praise the name of the Lord. And it's not living in the truth. But those who obey God's word truly show how completely they love him. Show the demonstrate that is how we know we are living in Him when we obey His word. You see, I want to take another level of this. You see, obeying God's word is also having faith in Him. You see, if we don't have faith in Him, you see, it is always difficult to obey Him. See, sometimes the reason why we, we find some of the scriptures so difficult to understand because we don't trust God. It may be something difficult for me to say to you right now, but that is what it is. You see, if our faith is in Him, hallelujah, it doesn't matter how challenging the word may be, we can move on with it. Let me show you a typical one. You know, Bible said that Peter said to him, Master, is that you? Lord, is that you? If it is you, command me to come. And Bible says that immediately Jesus confirmed his word. The guy stepped out. You see, he did not step out because I mean, uh, Jesus has said anything or something. But you see, he has so much faith in him. Praise the name of the Lord. So much faith in him that he didn't find it difficult that the guy wants him to drown. No. But because his faith is in him, he cannot the courage to move out. And may I challenge you today, this evening as well, if we have faith in his word, everything that he has said will take it serious. If we have any trust in his word, whatever he has said, we will take it serious. That is why it says that the only way we'll be able to find out whether we are with him, walking with him, staying in him, is to obey his word. I want to stop here because I want to pray with you. I want to pray with you. Today's prayer topic is to draw 
close to the Lord. To draw close. We've been falling out. We've been staying away from God. You see now, people want to come to church and pray, but you can't. You can't. But I believe this is a warning that we have been uh, we've been warned and from now on we are to uh, start moving ourselves up and taking our position as believers that we will not take things for granted anymore we will be serious with our work with God because we will now realize that that is the only thing we have Remember, Bible says everything is passing away. Everything, everything. But that which is still standing is the word of God. Which you and I are custodians of. It belongs to us. But how are we appropriating it? How are we using it in the name of Jesus? So, draw close to God. Ask God to forgive him. Maybe we are to pray the same prayer. Where we have been so disobedient. Where we have not been able to honor his word. We are to ask God to change us. The first prayer we are praying is, hey, Father, reveal anything in my life. Listen, you have it on the various platforms. You can read it yourself. Reveal anything in my life that would hinder my ability to come into your presence. What are you holding on that is not of God? What is the very thing that preventing you to serve God and serve Him? Truthfully, that is the prayer. This is the prayer we are taking. First prayer. May the Lord reveal anything, anything standing your way, preventing you. Begin to pray. Let it be a very honest prayer because we are moving on into a different level. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. All time of worshiping God is over. It's over. I said it's over. A moment that we are worshiping God, but at the same time we have things under the carpet. It's over. Let God reveal himself unto you. So it becomes you and him. Not anything else. Praise the name of the Lord. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Pray this prayer. Pray this prayer. Let it come out of your heart. Let it come out of your spirit. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Pray with me, somebody. Pray with me. Pray with me. In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Let us start right now in Jesus. A great change in the name of Jesus. A great move in the name of Jesus. In my kaba bobi anda ya mama, in my sate bere anda ya baba, in my sato bere anda ya baba, ya toka de ma sate bere anda ya baba, ya da bere anda ya baba. Father, Father, reveal anything in my life that will hinder my ability to come into your presence. You feel so guilty. The Spirit of God always convicts you. Hallelujah. You want to pray in the name of Jesus that there will be no condemnation. There will be no power. 
nothing will stand your way in the name of Jesus in between you and your father in the mighty name of Jesus in the name of Jesus we give you praise Lord we give you praise Lord yes Lord we honor you yes Lord we magnify you yes Lord we worship you in the name of Jesus we have right standing with God in the name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus in the mighty name of Jesus in the basso sakaya, yata yaba bosha baraba, yata le basa demini andaya, yata yaba bora kadaba, yata bene andaya baba, yata bana baba, yata bene andaya baba, yata besha kana. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, le boka yaba. Yanda bene andaya ba, yama sado. La bene andaya ba ba, lebran daya ba ba, yaba ba ba, yanda ya ba ba. In the name of Jesus, yaba ba we andaya ba ba, yanda ya ba ba, yanda ya ba ba, yanda ya ba ba, yanda bene andaya ba, yanda bene andaya ba ba. Yanda yaba bau, yanda yaba bau, yanda bene anda yaba bau, yanda bene anda yaba bau, yanda bene anda yaba bau, yanda pesh. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Psalm 24 is part of our prayer line. Verse number three. Who may climb? The mountain of the Lord, who may stand in his holy place. Listen to this. Only those who hands and hearts appear, who do not worship idols and never tell lies, worship idols. What are you talking about? Yes, you may not be going to visit Ephesus priest. But listen, there are certain things that we do all the time that takes the place of God. We value those things more than the God that delivers us. More than the God that has placed us in this advantageous position. And he says, yes, sir. Because of that. It takes us away from this presence. They will receive the Lord's blessings if we don't do that. And have right relationship with God, their Savior. In the name of Jesus. I want you to pray as we take our next prayer. As we take our next prayer. He says, yes, help me to see my partiality towards sin. And help me to change. Help me. You 
you are to pray to the Lord. Have anything in your life, in my life, that is not of God, we can't keep on holding on to it. We can't. It got to go. And we are praying. We are praying. Listen, it is better that we work with ourselves first. Better. Let our relationship with God be good. Hallelujah. And when it is good, listen to this. Hallelujah. It is so wonderful. Anything that the Lord has said in His Word concerning your life, it is at work for you. Begin to pray with me. Begin to pray with me. Begin to pray with me. Father, we thank you. We bless you. We honor you. We glorify you. Anything, oh God. Hallelujah. In me, in me, I pray that you help me to see my partiality in the name of Jesus. To listen. Convince me, Lord, in the name of Jesus. With your spirit in the name of Jesus. Let me understand, let me know in the name of Jesus. In Makabato Misabre Adayaba, Lebranda Yababore Kabaya Dayaba, Latebre Adayaba Bori Adayaba, Lebranda Yababori Adayaba, the Adabene Adayaba Bori Adayaba, the Abasha Paya Dayaba, Erebosha Karaba, the Adabene Adayaba, in the name of Jesus. Pray to God, pray to God in the name of Jesus. He and the Bene and the Yababa. He Yababa. La Bene and the Yababa. He and the Bene and the Yababa. In the Bene and the Bene and the Bene and the Bene. Miricada de Bene and the Yababa. He and the Barababa. He and the Yababa. He and the Bene and the Yababa. He and the Sobre and the Yababa. Lebranda Yabaha, Lebranda Yabaha, in Pakatusa, Lapene and Dayababa, in the name of Jesus, pray for yourself, pray for everyone, in the name of Jesus, we want to draw close to God, we want to draw close to the Lord, we want to do that, that is what is important. That is what, what is important. We need to work on it in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Lebranda Yabaha. Bible says that these people worship me with their lips, but their heart is so far away from me. We don't want that thing to happen to us. We want to worship God with all our heart, with all our mind, and every strength in us in the name of Jesus. La bene hakaya, le branta ya mama, le anda ba ya mama, la bene anda ya baba, le branta bene anda ya baba, le anda ba na mata bene anda ya baba, le anda 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 bene anda ya baba. Le boka ya, le boka ya. Lande bene anda ya baba, yanda bene anda ya baba, le branda ya baba, le masa de bene anda ya baba, yanda 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 bene anda ya baba. Jesus name, Jesus name, le baba, le branda ya baka tayi. We thank you, Lord. We bless you, Lord. We honor you, Lord. We glorify you, Lord. We give you praise, Lord. We give you glory in the mighty name of Jesus. We magnify you. Let my heart aya. La tebre anda ya ba. He anda bene anda ya ba. He makada bene anda ya ba ba. He anda 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 bene. Emato 
Sisibra La Debra Kayaba Katayaba Lemana Matapene Adayababao Lebra Dayababao in the name of Jesus Yamba Kapabo we meet Kabaya Lebra Dayababo Rabah Lebra Dayababo we Adayaba 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 Lebra Dayaba Lebra Dayaba Lebra Shaka to me Ibaba Libra, Libra, Yantaba Shakataya, Child of God, we are to take this serious, hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, mighty God. Paramakaya Babro Sika Baba Shakaba, Libro Satabaya, in the name of Jesus. We are to. Make sure that we maintain our position in the presence of the Lord where Holy Spirit will have the ability to control our lives. What do I mean by that? That we will be convicted, directed, Guided by the Holy Spirit. In the name of Jesus. Listen, listen. If as a believer you find it difficult to hear from the Spirit of God, you gotta pray this prayer one more time. Let's take it again. He says that Lord help me to see my partiality towards sin. You know sometimes there is a way you interpret sin. There is a way you interpret it because you want to sit you. You want to be okay with you. So you can maintain that kind of lifestyle. So you interpret it in a way that will be so right in your own eyes. But you know clearly that that is not how the word of God says. And we want to pray that we are ready for that change. You also need to be willing, sincerely willing, for that change to take place in your life and in my life. Begin to pray right now in Jesus' name. One more time. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Lebra to sakabaha. Le masaka yemra to kababa. Lord God, we thank you. Lord God, we bless you. Lord God, we honor you. We glorify you. In the name of Jesus. Sabaya. Yada de basota yebrahaka. Le ba yada yababo we anda yabaha. Le ba kayada yababo. Le masanda be ne anda yabaha. Le branda yababo we anda yabaha. Le masaka do sabina. E mata be ne anda yababo. Le branto sakata ye. Le ba ha. Le bra ha. In the name of Jesus. Le bra ha. Le masaka ya, la debre anda ya, le ba ya, le branda ya, le mashaba ya. In the name of Jesus, ya ba 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 ba, imakata ya, ya da ya ba ba, imasabe ne anda ya ba. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, ya da ba ne manaka do zakaya. In Jesus name. We want to take our next prayer. We want to take our next prayer. We want to pray that you will come to a point that you will see sin the way God sees it. I 
I said, you will see it the way God sees it. Meaning that we will not play with it. Because it prevents us. You know, remember, Bible says that if our heart does not condemn us, we come before the throne of God with boldness. You see, God has already forgiven us. But the enemy will let you know that you have sinned. And that will hold you back. The enemy will condemn you, even though the Bible says that, therefore now there is no condemnation. We want to pray in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Begin to pray, begin to pray, begin to pray that you will not waste away your life. You will not waste away your time. You will not waste away your work with God. But you will be fervent, courageous in the name of Jesus. And those petty, petty things will not come in your way in the name of Jesus. You will be strong and courageous in Jesus' mighty name. Lade Shabbat. Kabayadahi. Losika do simra da yanda ya la bo shaka ba ya da bene anda ya ba ya da bene anda ya ba ba ya da ba ro ka ba ya da ya e ma sa bene anda ya e ma ka ba ya da ya ba e ma to se ma ka ba ya ba le bra to shaka ya in the name of Jesus hallelujah la de bra da ya ba this fast in hallelujah read the fast your position in Christ in the name of Jesus. This fasting, hallelujah, change your lifestyle. This fasting, make sure you are standing right with God. This fasting, make sure that his death has not been in vain in the name of Jesus, hallelujah. He took away, he took our place, and he took away our sins. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Heavenly Father, we thank you. In Jesus' name. We want to take the next prayer. Point. It says that thank you for loving me. In spite of my failures. What a wonderful God. See, this is the God we serve. Hallelujah. He does not condemn us. He does not condemn us. When we fail, he doesn't, I mean, rebuke us. But he wants us to change. He wants us to change. He said, Lord, it is your loving kindness that leads me to repentance. We want to pray in the name of Jesus. We want to pray that whatever that has gone wrong in your life, even as we speak right now, that which is going wrong in your life there is one who loves you more than anyone else why don't you rededicate your life back up to him why don't you go back to him hallelujah Bible says that when the lost son said to himself I have a father my father has so many laborers my father is rich my father is good and kind yes i have done something wrong but i will return back to my father i will go back he said to himself you see when he was saying this he wasn't even sure so at the point he said to himself that even if he's not willing to take me as a son as i was I know my father is so much of good spirit. He will take me in as what? A servant. You want to go back to God? Let's go back to God, people of God. Many times that we use church to cover things up. But people of God, not anymore. Not anymore. You see, there is a revival coming. I said there is a revival coming. And now the eyes of the people of God are going to be open. And we are going to get better understanding of the word of God now. And how important we are to trust him. Begin to pray 
anything was in your life he's the restorer God is the restorer begin to pray to him begin to call him call him let him restore you back in the name of Jesus as the son the lost son was restored you are going to be restored in the name of Jesus anything that you we are doing in the secret the restorer is here in the name of Jesus anything that is not going right the restorer is here in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus mighty God we thank you mighty God we bless you we give you praise in the name of Jesus we we'll take our next prayer it says pray and ask the Lord to bring you fully into his presence daily daily you see you, we are not going to live in the life of inconsistency today we are there tomorrow we are there and sometimes we don't even know where we are no more in the name of Jesus we are going to pray and ask the Lord to bring us back. God has this ability to bring us back. He is a restorer. He is a restorer in the name of Jesus. The restorer in the name of Jesus. You want to pray. You want to pray and ask the Lord to bring you fully back into his presence. When you wake up in the morning, you hear from the Lord. During the day, you hear from the Lord. In the night you hear from the Lord. When you are sleeping, you will hear from the Lord. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. In the name of Jesus. Begin to pray. Begin to pray. In Jesus' mighty name. Jesus. In the name of 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 Jesus. Let Shabbat. La bene anda ya baba hu, le branda ya baba hu. In the name of Jesus, we give you praise, Lord. We give you praise, Lord. Le branda ya baba hu, le mashaba ya hu, le mata bene anda, la de branto shakaya. In Jesus' name, Father, we thank you. We bless you. In the name of Jesus, Hallelujah. We also want to pray this prayer. You are to ask the Lord to lead you more fully into his will so that every day of your life will be worship, offering, hallelujah, in his presence, hallelujah, in his glory, in the name of Jesus, a living sacrifice so that we bring him nothing but his glory, our lives will be speaking of God every single day. Our lives will be testimony to our friends and neighbors and the people that know us. In the name of Jesus, we'll be glorifying the Lord because His Spirit is in us. In the name of Jesus, shall we begin to pray? Shall we begin to pray? In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. Mighty God, we thank you. Mighty God, we bless you. 
mighty God, we give you praise, we give you glory. In the mighty name of Jesus, let him in the Andayabaha. Lebranda Yababo Kabini, Imarabaya, Yandayababo, Lebra Sotri Edaba, Etapini Andayababo, Lebra Tayababo, we Andayabo, Yababo, Rakayabo, Yandabini Andayabo, Yandabini Andayabo, Yandabini Andayabo, Lebra Satini Andayabo, Lebra Tababo, we Imama, Lebra Satini Andayabo. Let my cadabe, 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 my shakataya, Lebro Sakaya, La Pene Adayababa, La Pene Adayabaha, 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 Jesus. Keep on praying, hallelujah. Keep on praying in the name of Jesus. Labene ah, labene ah, ibaka de bene endaba, lebra to zibre andayaba, labene andayaba, lebaya enda bene adaya, lebro sakaya, labene ah, yanda bene ah. Yanda bene au, yanda ya baba, lebranda ya baba, lima kada bene anda ya baba, yanda bene anda ya baba, yanda ya baba, yanda ya baba, lebra sakaya, lebra shakaya, lebra shakaya. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, la bene anda ya baba, lima sakaya, lebranda ya baba. Lebra Sakaya, Lebaya Nabohu, in the name of Jesus, Labene Andaya, Labene Andaya, Labene Andaya, in the Meneko Shakaya, Lebra Dayabahu, Yatayababahu, 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 Yatabe Shakayaba, Latebene Andayabahu, Yatabene Pash, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. We want to pray this prayer. We want to pray this prayer. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. You know, Bible says. that is going on we are declaring the hand of God over the nations of the earth in the name of Jesus the nations of the earth everywhere in Jesus name we are asking the Lord God to rule in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus we may not know we may not understand we're trying to put it together but it doesn't work. But the one that knows everything, he's our father. So Philippians chapter 4 verse number 6, it says, be careful for nothing, but in everything, prayer. We want to pray to our God. Heal our nations, our land. Everyone is protected and guided in the name of Jesus. Shall we begin to pray? Shall we begin to pray? Pray with me, somebody. Pray with me. Pray with me tonight in the name of Jesus. Pray with me tonight in the name of Jesus. La de Makayabaha. Lebro Shaka Babobi and Dayabaha. Lebra Shaka Babobi and Dayabaha. Emma Shaka Babobi and Dayabaha. 
in the name of Jesus Jesus in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus we want to pray the last prayer you want to pray and commit yourself and your family into the hands of God he says I will give angels a charge over you God said that he will give his angels a charge a command for them to protect you for them to protect your family and will not come near you you see I said you got to have faith in the Lord to use his word rightly if you don't have faith in him when he says that it will not come near you you will still panic You will stop panic. But if you have faith in him, when he says that it will not come near you, you will know that it will not come near you. Shall we begin to pray? In the name of Jesus, hallelujah. In the name of Father, we thank you. We bless you. We bless you. In the name of Jesus, Abayakaya, La de Brataya Babahu, the Antapa Rakaya Baba, the Antapene Andayaba, the Antapa Raba Shakaya, the Antapene Andayaba, 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 in the name of Jesus, it will not come near you. It will not come near you. In the name of Jesus, proclaim the word of God. Proclaim the word of God. The only power that is out there that is so powerful, it is the word and the promises that He has given. La bene andaya ha le broka baya da ya baba ha shia bara baba ho le brata bene andaya ba ha sheka baya ba ho ya da bene andaya ba ha le branta ya baba ho le branta ya baba ho ka bene andaya in the name of jesus thank you lord jesus hallelujah you see there was a command that they should, they should use the blood as a signpost. Signpost. And they were living, they were not living separately. They were living on the land, the same land. But indeed, the word of God came to pass for them. I want to assure you through the word of God, of course, that God is with you. He says he will not leave you and he will not forsake you. You are part of his family. His eye on you. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God keep you. In the name of Jesus, may you sleep and sleep well. May your hope in him never fail. In the name of Jesus, may your walk be protected by Jehovah God. All the days of your life, may you walk in the goodness of the Lord. May Jehovah God look on you favorably in the name of Jesus and bless you and make you fruitful. In the name of Jesus, the Lord God is his name. God bless you. Thank you in the name of Jesus. 
Hallelujah. Amen. Uh, as you all know, just before we share the grace, as you all know, today is day two. We'll be here again tomorrow, coming your way. Hallelujah. Please keep on praying at home. Hallelujah. Study the word of God as you can. Hallelujah. The whole thing is about getting closer to God. Hallelujah. We want to come back. We want to come back. We want to take our original place in the name of Jesus. God bless you. Hallelujah. For waiting before the presence of the Lord. Amen. It is the right time. This is the right time for us to pray. So if you are praying with us, you are doing the right thing. And may the Lord God bless you in the name of Jesus. Now can I ask you to lift up your hands wherever you are. May the Lord God bless you. May the Lord God keep you. May his face shine upon you in the name of Jesus. May your ways be blessed in the name of Jesus. May you walk in his goodness all the days of your life. In the darkness, hovering around because of the light that is in you. May you shine above in the name of Jesus. May you rise above. Bible says that the enemy may come like a flood. But there is a spirit in you. There is a power in you to lift you up in the name of Jesus. May you be lifted up in the name of Jesus. I said, may you be lifted up in the name of Jesus. May you be lifted up above all things. In Jesus' name. You will not be flooded. I say you will not be flooded by the the, the, the evil things that are going on, you will not be. You are in the hands of God. And he will take good care of you. Child of God, you are blessed. Shall we share the grace? The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. The love of God. Fellowship of the Holy Spirit. Be with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. God bless you. God bless you.